to celebrate one Mr. Bayani Pena and his completion of his high school graduation requirements. Let's give one big round of applause for Mr. Bayani. Folks will help you out to get to this point. Since the beginning, it was Ms. Bowles, and, and then it just ended up being everyone because I was switching classes because I just gave up on them myself. And they didn't give up on me. They kept pushing me, especially Mr. Anthony, Mr. Albright, and Mr. Lopez. Y'all believed in me, and I didn't. But I somehow woke up one day and just told myself, just get it done, and that's what I did. He's going to graduate, and what can I say? I'm very happy. I'm very proud of him. I'm, I'm glad he did it. Awesome. But Yari, what's next? College, just college with, with the road brings me, just trying to be someone in life. Well, you are someone already, Biani. You've shown yourself to be a great young man. Uh, we have really appreciated your time here. We really appreciate you see all the good things. And there's so much good about Biani uh, from his heart to his, to his mind. He's just an incredible young man and really proud that he's now a Crossroads graduate. So congratulations, Mr. Biani. <laughs> I love you and I'm going to miss you. Thank you for being a part of my life. All I got to say is don't give up and appreciate what you got because that is all I have. You see people coming in with all their family. That's my only family. Y'all appreciate what I have and don't give up. Hey. All right, we are here with Miss Jalissa Duron, Crossroads Academy High School's newest graduate and mom, Stephanie Silguero, Ms. Silguero. Yes. Um, Ms. Delissa, can you tell me a little bit about what it feels like to, have, to get to this point in your academic career? It feels good. A lot of stress off my shoulders. To go to college and graduate with a good degree. Okay, excellent. We look forward to that. Um, Ms. Silguero, can you tell me a little bit about what it feels like to be here with Delissa at this moment? Well, I'm proud of her. I pushed her a lot to do it. She finally did it. Being that she has a two month old baby and COVID and stressing of being a new mom, she finally did it. Well, Jalissa, we're very proud of you. We're excited what the future holds. Every time you've turned it on here to do good work, you've done great things and our entire team is proud of you and looks forward to great things for you, okay? Congratulations. Thank you. Yay. I just want to say how proud I am. She did just have a baby and she had to put up with me texting and mom and grandma and she's probably like Miss Hoffman, but she just had a baby and she came back. A total inspiration um, and a good example for you guys. I just, I'm so proud of you. And Miss Janice, if you'd like, you say a few words to your classmates. Um, y'all could do it, and like she said, she'll get a hold of your grandma, your mom, <laughs> everybody to get you through it. Find over matter. Get it done. Yes. All right, let's make one more big round of applause for Mr. Lisa.